right. Well, I met her friends, I met her folks, and they were all chock full of jokes to me. They all seemed nice. We dated through the years, we tied the knot and shifted gears. I thought that everything was grand. Well, I talked to her dad, and he was kind of a strange lad. He said, boy, you ain't just getting that left hand. place where we never thought we'd see them again. She looked across the road and I heard her sigh, oh no, there stood her brother and her cousin, his best friend. Well, they knocked on the door and they knocked and knocked some more. I finally got up and replied. Well, he asked for a hundred bucks and I said, boy, you must be nuts. He said, come on, man. Just want to get fried. Well, no one in her family has a real job. Well, they all run guns and liquor and hide out from the mall. And it's the strangest thing that you've ever almost saw. My in-laws are outlaws. Well, her uncle was an old dude who had dogs and chased coons and three years in, of a stroke. Well, both his boys were breaking bad, about sold off all they had, but the police caught both of them with the dope. Well, now it's present day, they're all gone, locked away. And they can't knock no more, so they just call. Well, a few have found the Lord, have one or two have hit the floor. But every now and then we miss them all. I do love this girl, but my in-laws are out.